Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. 2018 Fireballs here, back with another MLB 9 Innings 22 video. We're with the Astros team today, and we have a ton of packs to go through. We have three all-star player packs, a signature player pack, three live season diamond packs. I haven't checked my inventory in a couple days, and I had no idea that I got three live season diamond player packs. I don't think I have any on my other teams, but that's pretty insane luck right there, getting that many live diamond packs from league mode. And we also have all these other packs that we're going to open up. So let's get straight into it. We'll start off with the silver player packs. Uh, looking for upgrade material for Justin Verlander. I used all my Verlanders and tried to upgrade him. And uh, unfortunately, none of them were successful. There's a Martin Maldonado that I can use for upgrades, which is nice to see. But I hope you guys enjoyed the All-Star break and All-Star game. The American League, once again, is proven itself to be the king of the all-star game in the past nine seasons which is pretty insane i'm an american league uh fan myself so there's a brooks Raley. we can use that for upgrade material um but i it's kind of crazy the al has just won so many all-star games in the past years it's getting uh crazy at this point Ooh, is that the fifth the 53 base miguel and duhar so we pulled uh, Frank Schwindel on the Red Sox team a little while back and now we get uh, This has to be the second or third worst card in the game Miguel and Duhar Wow, okay So there's our first diamond of today's video with the signature player pack again hoping for no trolls There's another Yankee uh, Rudy May but uh, Yeah, come to us gave out a free signature pack from the all-star game, which was pretty unexpected I'm not gonna complain though uh, an all-star card is, or not an all-star card, a signature player pack is, I'll take that any any day of the week, to be honest. Alright, we're doing only 50 premium player packs, because we have so many other just random premiums to, to open up. Let's do the pitcher packs. Another diamond out of these, we've pulled a lot of diamonds out of pitcher and batter packs on the Houston Astros team. Who's this going to be? It's a Hembry. No idea why he's still in the game. I believe he's playing for the Pirates right now. Not a really good card. I can't wait till his card's out of the game so I stop pulling him. Um, also, just watched the All-Star Game highlights. Um, kind of underwhelming. Uh, I mean, it was pretty cool. It looked like the seats were pretty empty, though, at Dodger Stadium, which is pretty surprising. I thought it was pretty surprising. I thought more people would actually be there. I didn't watch the Home Run Derby, but I do know who won. I won't spoil it for anybody who hasn't watched the highlights but yeah i just the all-star game wasn't as exciting as other all-star games were like the 2018 all-star game um but the mic'd up moments are pretty cool to see i believe they're kind of do, they're doing them a bit too much even then now um there's just something special about having mic'd up moments and seeing them at the all-star game but you know when only a select few players get to get mic'd up that's what's fun about it they pretty much had every person they possibly could get mic'd up so that's just my thoughts on that let's do some ultimate player packs can we get two diamonds out of this okay just one diamond out of the ultimates let's see how many diamonds we can get that are live cards now we have two ultimate live player packs let's see who we can get out of these and we do get a diamond so hoping for an astro <laughs> of course we pull a dodger it's a uh, Walker Bueller is not doing too well, but um, I also have to show you guys this. I almost forgot I did pull an Eric Gagne Diamond Prime from Mission Boxes. And of course, it's on my Astros team. I'm not going to complain though. He's an awesome card, and I will somehow fit him into the lineup, probably replacing Tony Sip eventually since Sip has been out of the game for just ages and he needs upgrade material and he can't get that same for Gagne so he's the better card I'll definitely use him in the future in replacement all right live season diamond player packs three of them can we get a Houston Astro I remember I pulled Jordan Alvarez last year he actually has player of the month if I pulled him again that'd be insane <laughs> no but we get two Red Sox oh man I could use that Schreiber 
I really could use that Schreiber. Schreiber is like the only good Red Sox relief pitcher. Or only good Red Sox pitcher in general. And I already have Story, so that's not really a big thing. And this Tristan McKenzie is not terrible either. So three really, really good live diamonds right here. Wow, okay. Was not expecting that, but we did get trolled. Hoping that's not the case for the signature player pack. Let's get these all-star player packs out of the way first. We'll get the AL all-star player pack first. Let's see if we can get an Astro. If it is an Astro, I might grade increase it. I don't know. I uh, know, of course. It's a Tampa Bay Ray. Mike Zanino, 2021. Cool all-star card right there. Now the NL all-star card. Uh, not really expecting much from this. I guess we'll do an all-star combo if uh, we don't get any Astros. Ooh, that's a really nice Stanton. That's his... This is probably one of the best all-star cards out there. Uh, probably Joey Gallo is another really good one to get. All right, ultimate all-star pack. Can we get a diamond out of the ultimate? No, it's going to be a gold. All right, who's it going to be? Uh, Brad Hand. I think I pulled him already before. But uh, we'll do a all-star combo after the signature player pack. And uh, just hoping for no trolls, please. It's not a diamond. It is a silver card, and we get a Nick Castellanos. All right. So not an Astros card. We'll be saving that for a SIG combo later down the line. Let's go ahead and do upgrades and then do that all-star combo. Not that we'll get anything from it, but we'll do this Martin Maldonado. Let's see if we can get success. Nope. All right, Brooks Raley. This one I'd really like to go up. The decent card. And no, no success there. All right. Anything in the backups? Mm, just that story. Nope. Okay. So let's do that all star combo. And uh, I might as well finish my. Uh, oh, what do you call it? But, uh, finish special training. That's what I was meaning to say on my George Springer so you guys can see that. And we pull a Suarez. Good Reds card. Solid Reds card. Not his best year, but still really good. Alright, let's special train George Springer. We should be able to get him to level 8 with this. All the cards that we have. I have uh, Raleigh Fingers to take to... Uh, not take to Black Diamond, but... I do want to... Um get pitcher's chemistry on him all right there we go maxing george springer out now moving on to the next player after that i don't know i might just save all of those live cards really wish i could have pulled that schreiber on my red Sox account though that, that kind of hurts all right premium skill change tickets are also on sale i might buy them but i don't really want to because the luck with them has just not been there all right, skill change tickets. We'll be doing um, these on Justin Verlander, hoping for a good skill set, and hoping to replace him with Scott Casimir, or replace Scott Casimir with him. There's finesse pitcher. I'd like to see that paired with something else. Ooh, it's low levels, but I'll have to stick with it. I'll open up a skill storage slot uh, when double mileage comes around. But uh, the, those are low levels. I'm not going to keep that for long. I'm, I'm going to keep it for now, but uh, that, that'll do. Uh, I'm actually satisfied with that. Let me see if I have anybody else that I need to skill change. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and skill change this Ganya and see if we can roll something on him. Uh, so I can get him in my lineup. He will be a 26th or 25th man. Ooh, so close right there. Set, set a man inning eater. If that inning eater was something like boss or finesse. Another really good skill. Ooh, this is a decent one, but too bad it's low levels. Ah, seeing really good skill sets right now, but low levels. If that were a 3-3-3, that would have been a keeper for me. Okay, last one. Alright, and nothing. So, we did get success on Verlander. 
Now let's use these premiums on Raleigh Fingers. Don't have high expectations. Looking for pitcher's chemistry. Not expecting to get it. Nothing right there. Nothing there. And strike three. Now we get a bonus. Last one. Please. Oh, it's bullpen day. Well, it's good on a relief pitcher, but uh, again, no luck with premiums. I was planning on grade increasing Andre Dawson, but I still don't feel like it's the right time. I just don't want to use the grade increase ticket on him. There's better cards out there. He's good, good grade increase distribution, but I just don't. I can't convince myself to use it. I might go with Jose Altuve on the Wish Player Pack later on too, uh, just because his card is really good. But uh, once again, we get Trolled, we get Trevor Story, and we get Schreiber, literally the best Red Sox pitcher right now, this, the only Red Sox pitcher that I want on my team. But uh, that's going to pretty much do it for today's video, guys. If you did enjoy, don't forget to hit the like button down below and subscribe to the channel. Uh, feel free to check out my Discord server and my social media platforms as well. And uh, if you haven't, go ahead and check out the other MLB 9 Innings YouTubers that I've listed in the description box as well. And with all that said, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I will see you all in the next video.